Alright guys, so hello, this is The Bong on YouTube channel. So in today's video guys, I will be showing you a new OX Lib redesign. And actually you can, you know, you can edit this one. But today, as you can see this one, um, let's try to drink, drink some water. Ah, oh, it's so beautiful. And look at that notification right there. You'll see it's kind of different. You know, uh, let's try to buy something here. Um, there you go, guys. You purchased the burgers. Um, oh my god, you know, the design is so beautiful. So, guys, if you want to install this on your 5M server, just follow my video. Alright, so let's start. We have to download the GitHub you know github script link i don't know how to speak it but you know you just have to click this green button right here it says download zip so you just have to click that and it will magically download to your download folder so guys if you're wondering where is the link of this you know you know script so actually i'm not adding it on my description but i will add it matically on the video you, you just have to watch the video and it will pop up there okay so so you know um <laughs> so <laughs> let's go let's go let's go wow we go down to our download folder and there we go we just have to extract this one by uh, using winrar and here we go this is it we just have to rename this one just f2 and double and you just have to rename this one you just remove the dash main so that the script will work properly now the next up is you just have to open your you need to open your sorry you need to open your uh, 5m resources uh, server 5M server resources. So, so mine is located at my drive E and 5M development and server and QBox, then resources. And there we go. Since we're using a QBox, so we are um, the OX folder is already added here. We just have to open this, and here we go. There are a lot of you know um, OX script here. We just have to back up this if so that you know we can revert back to our uh, we can revert our changes if it doesn't work okay so you just have to delete this one and go back to uh, download portion and then you have to copy the folder of the script that you have downloaded earlier just copy this one and go back to ox and paste it here and there we go we just have to open our 5m and see if it will works so first up don't forget to you know you have to restart your 5m server so actually i'm using a console you just have to open this local localhost and there we go so this is the uh, the process on how to open your uh, tx admin console you just have to restart this one um, you can clear that out so that you will see and there you go it's running and you can control F and type for OX LED and you'll see that the OX LED is working properly okay now let's check let's um let's connect to our let's go and connect to our 5M server there we go we just have to mute this one. And there you go. As you can see, the changes is already added here. The redesign of OX Lab is, you know, it's so beautiful. You can see this out. It's you know um it's kind of like an overlay thing. Actually, you can edit it. You just have to go to uh, you just have to check the link, uh the GitHub page, and you'll see this one. If you want to make changes of the design, this is how you would go. Okay, 
so that's it we have to open this one oh my god it's so beautiful you can see this one and there we go um let's try to eat something as you can see guys at the top right corner you will see the new design of our ox lib you know it's kind of beautiful i'm not changing it anymore okay so let's go to the nearest you know store let's go there we just have to uh you know we just have to tp all right there we go and here we go there we go we can open the shop and let's buy something there we go guys as you can see guys it's you know it's popping up and when we open this burger here oh my god it's you know it's kind of different from other cds and you know um i think you can use uh slash ox lib there we go so this option you can change which one would you like to pop up the notification um mine is the default is the bottom right corner so i'm not gonna change that one and you know i love it i'll i really love it so guys if you like this video please you know please subscribe to my channel for more video tutorial like this okay so that's it for today's video bye bye